How to make a narcissist panic. Being around a narcissist can cause you to lose your courage and self-confidence. It can make you feel frightened and nervous because you never know what they're going to do next. They will lower their moral standards so far and do something reprehensible to gain attention, to gain power and control over you. But there is a way for you to reverse the situation and gain the upper hand. Narcissists may seem frightening and intimidating, but they're actually very fragile and insecure. They're shame-based people who are doing everything they can to avoid reflecting on their shame. So nothing terrifies them more than the possibility of them being exposed for who they are. If you want to make a narcissist panic, start speaking on what they're doing. Start pointing out their flaws. Start pointing out the inconsistencies in their stories and back it up with undeniable proof or evidence. They may not agree, but it will make them panic. Because they know that what they're saying is stupid and untrue. So when you start speaking on it, and you start exposing them for who they are, it makes them panic. Nothing terrifies them more than having no protection from something harmful. Than the revelation of their embarrassing and damaging secrets because they need to have control over other people's perceptions. They need to have control over how other people see them. And they do that through manipulation. But if they feel that they are unable to manipulate people's perceptions, they will panic. Narcissists will panic around anyone who have confidence in their own worth and abilities. Anyone who respects themselves. Anyone who has a strong opinion of themselves. Anyone who is satisfied with their lives. Anyone who is in a position of power. They cannot be around authentic people. They cannot be around people who have a strong character because they can't manipulate or control a person like that. They can't control how you see yourself. They can't control how you see other people. And they can't control how you see them, which will cause unrest and instability in the narcissist. Because then they're not in a position of power and control, which is what they need to feel stable and secure. Narcissists need to keep you in a state where you are in fear of loss. But when you are confident in your own worth and abilities, they can't do that. Narcissists need you to abandon yourself first before you will then fear losing them. As long as you hold on to your character, you will not fear them leaving you and it will trigger their abandonment issues. It will make them panic.
So essentially, to make a narcissist panic, you need to stay calm. You need to avoid appearing surprised or worried because all they're really looking for is your reaction to what they're saying or doing. Which is why they will try to provoke you. They will threaten you. They will intimidate you. But if they can't make you nervous, worried or irritated, it will give you the upper hand. It will make them panic. As long as you are reacting to the narcissist, they will feel comfortable. They will feel powerful and in control as long as you are engaged with them. So to make the narcissist panic, you need to go no contact. They will try to re-engage, but if they still don't get a response, it makes them feel unimportant. It tells them that they're unworthy of your time and attention and it makes them panic. To make the narcissist panic, they have to know that they can't affect you. They can't manipulate or control you. They can't get a reaction out of you. They can't get narcissistic supply. Because now you're the one rejecting them and showing them intentional unfriendliness rather than it being the other way around. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.